So, you get to the checkout and there's a problem with the purchase. What do you do? If the cashier is unable to help, ask the store manager to do a balance inquiry, help walk through the transaction, and answer any questions. There are a few reasons a food may not scan as WIC allowed. A food may not scan as WIC allowed because the food is not an approved WIC item. Also, be sure the size and brand are approved. Check the WIC shopping guide for food requirements. Another reason a food may not scan as WIC allowed is that you may not have benefits available in your account. Check your food balance to make sure you have enough benefits left in your account. Look at your previous receipt or use the Wisconsin MyWIC app to easily see your current benefit balance. Sometimes a food may not scan, even though it is WIC approved, because it might not be in the computer system. If you believe the product was rejected in error, take a picture of the item, including the UPC barcode, keep the receipt, and contact your local WIC office. Remember, though, that WIC cannot repay you for any items purchased with another form of payment. The fruits and vegetables didn't show as being paid by WIC. Why? Sometimes buying fresh fruits and vegetables can be tricky. You know an item is allowed, but the cash register system says it's not. This can happen because UPC barcodes change a lot and the new code may not be in the WIC system yet. You can either pay for it using another form of payment or ask the cashier to remove any items you do not want to buy. You can't use your card because the PIN is locked. Now what? If the PIN is entered incorrectly four times, your PIN will lock. If you know the PIN, call the number on the back of the card or go to the website to enter the correct PIN. Your PIN will then unlock at midnight. If you forgot your PIN, call your local WIC office to unlock it. You can use your card and PIN immediately after it is unlocked and a new PIN is set. Contact your WIC office as soon as possible if you were not able to buy a food that you think is WIC approved, had foods incorrectly removed from your benefits, or your receipt doesn't match what you bought, have a complaint about how you were treated by store staff, or if you have any questions about shopping for WIC foods. Want to know more? Visit dhs.wisconsin.gov slash WIC.